so excited for this fun trip today. Ooh, popcorn. Very sweet folks with lots of popcorn flavors. Yum. Look at the miniature popcorn heater. Ice cream and popcorn are our weaknesses. On the chain. <laughs> popcorn. But if you ask me a question and I do not know the answer to it, trust me. I'm going to make something up. You ain't going to know the difference. <laughs> he made this trip so much fun. Thanks, Tim. for them to move the engine to the back. We put it in fast forward for you. <laughs> and here are the cool bits in normal time. If you're wondering where the steam engine is, it is getting a new set of wheels this month. So we were pulled by the diesel engines today. Let's see. Woo. Yep, there it goes. <laughs> I told you. I was Oh, you're quite welcome. Thank you for being here. It's an absolutely marvelous place. And it's even more marvelous with Lisa on my side. Thank you. Here at the NOC, you can rent boats and bikes and eat lots of food and probably a lot more than that. NOC is short for Nantahala Outdoor Center, just in case you were wondering. Of course, it's always time for ice cream. <laughs> this cool bug is hitchhiking on David's knee.
wish you to have a great day with us and hope that you'll come back soon. Thank you. We did have an absolutely fabulous time. Thanks, Tim. And this video can't even begin to capture the beauty of everything we saw today. I bet you thought the video was over. Well, it's not because there is a train museum at this depot. Take a look. I have never seen such a huge model train display in my life. even a drive-in. They've even gotten a little creative. <laughs> In the next room over, they have this large-scale diorama set up with interactive buttons, so you get to make everything in the display move, and that's a lot of fun for the kiddos and me. <laughs> that's a lot of trains. There were two large rooms filled with these display cases of trains of all kinds. I'm no expert, but I know they're special in some way, and I'm grateful for the people who love them and collect them and make them available for us to appreciate. I really didn't know what to expect from the Rocky Mountains, so it exceeded my expectations. I had no idea what a beautiful, amazing place this was. And as this video comes to an end, I want to say thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.